the Laurel Street Tabernacle in Indianapolis, Indiana, appears to be the church where Jim Jones of People's Temple was recruited into William Branham's message cult following. During the early years of Jim Jones' ministry in Indianapolis, and prior to the formation of People's Temple, Jones was an aspiring healing revivalist with strong ties to the latter rain version of William Branham's message. Laurel Street Tabernacle was affiliated with the Assemblies of God sect before the Assemblies split when it denounced William Branham's latter rain doctrine. This split was significant as it relates to Jim Jones and People's Temple. Roy Weed, Lester Sumrall, and Jim Jones chose to break from the main sect of the Assemblies and join William Branham's latter rain through the Independent Assemblies of God led by A.W. Rasmussen and Joseph Matson Bose. Roy H. Weed was the first district superintendent for the Assemblies of God in Indiana. Weed was the youth and missions director for Ohio and Indiana, known by most pastors in the state. His son, Doug Weed, was an advisor for two American presidents and a special assistant to George H. W. Bush. Weed was married to Rosa May Short, the daughter of a famous Pentecostal evangelist, Willa J. Short, who falsely posed as a widow during her ministry in Texas. Weed became a leader in Branham's sect, writing publications describing why he sided with William Branham after the split by the Assemblies of God. According to Weed, it was, quote, God's plan that all hear this message, referring to the latter rain version of William Branham's message called following. You can learn this and more on william-branham.org.